algae fans. I wanted to give you a brief tutorial on how to do this gene searching again. And so if you bring up the gene cards, uh, www.genecards.org site, and let's just say you type in based on their keyword, the let's pick a gene called SOX1. All right, you type that in, you hit the search button. What it'll do is bring up for you a list of genes that are have similarity to that SOX1 name. And the first one on this list is called SOX1, so I'm going to click on that, open that page. And this gives you, you could read through this whole page. It would give you a lot of information about your gene. But for today, what we were hoping to do was to get the nucleotide sequence downloaded and the amino acid sequence downloaded for this particular gene. Right. There's a b multiple ways uh, to go about doing this. Uh, I'd like you to try uh, either to try the Entras gene or the Ensemble. So I'm going to click on the Ensemble in the middle of the page. And when you open that new page, what it's going to do is give you some more information. So you see that this gene SOX1 is actually got another name called SRY, the sex determining region, the Y box. and in this, what it's doing is showing you, there's actually quite a bit of information on this page in the box that I am circling. And so here, what you can see is CCDS, that's CCDS, if you click on that, that's the complete coding sequence. And it gives you both the nucleotide, if I scroll down on this page, you see that we're looking at Homo sapiens, and it has both the nucleotide sequence as well as the translation, so the uh, amino acid sequence. And you could begin building your document by copying and pasting these sequences into your document. We'll be using these sequences on Thursday and continuing throughout the semester, so please get this information uh, into your document so that we can do some additional work. Thank you and have a great day.